Yeah, it felt amazing getting back out there. I mean, you had been taking at bats and whatnot for a while, though. So. Yeah, I was taking some at bats in the backfields, but I mean, it was your calf. Yes, uh, just a small little mild strain, I was told. So, um, yeah, it was good getting back back out there, getting some adrenaline going, and just having some fun with my my teammates. When you when you think about that second time up last year and beyond, what adjustments did you make or approach or to have the success that you did relative to the first time? I believe that was just being more comfortable around my teammates, um, getting confidence from them, just having more confidence in myself and uh, taking a step back and making the situation a little bit smaller because it's a it's big and um, it can get the best to you if you let it so just trying to be disciplined and rely on my staff and teammates when it comes to your defense I mean yesterday was another great example the defense is probably one of your biggest calling cards what do you think attributes to that success what what makes you you know maybe above average even better than that defender in the outfield um, a lot of practice a lot of time and, and practice and uh, by me and put it put into me by uh, coaches and teammates, but uh, I think that comes from self belief, self confidence too. Um, I believe that I'm the best out there, uh, so I think that shows. Is it a first step kind of thing? Is it your reads? What do you think? Do you think really excels for you to make those plays? Uh, I'm comfortable, so I think that I can just rely on instincts and uh, yeah like last year I worked on first step a lot with uh, QB and that's helped so how do you work on that is like live first step. batting practice stuff? yeah most mostly just work on it in, in BP and then experiment in games um, see what's working what's not working uh, that's kind of did you is, ever, is there one spot that you feel more comfortable than the other I know you can in the outfield play them all, yeah. No, I think at this point, like, I've played all of them enough to, to be just as confident and uh, comfortable in, in all three positions. Yeah. Can we talk about comfort level, if we go back to that just for a second? Mm -hmm. Football players say the game slows down. In, in your world, with your after the second trip up last year, how did it change in that regard, if you compared it to that? Yeah, yeah. I, like, the first time, stuff was moving fast. Yeah. Uh, it was trying to, you know, get, get my bearings and... When I was able to come up the second time, that's what I kind of mean by just felt a little bit more comfortable around my teammates, around kind of the, how things work, the schedule. So the game itself could could it could slow down as well. And um, like I said, just teammates giving me confidence and having a little bit more in my end as well. Does that make this feel more comfortable, or is it different because now there are different bodies in the outfield, even you know with Jackson in there and, and spots being fought for? Um, I would say that I'm not. I would say this: I, healthy competition is good, um, so I enjoy it a lot. Uh, having them push me and hopefully I push them back a little bit. Um, definitely not comfortable in the stance of I'm comfortable with where I am on in the roster, but. Uh, I think it's good to have healthy competition. It pushes all of us to be better and uh, can't take any opportunity for granted. Did you play any other sports? Growing up? Yeah. Um, yeah, I played a lot growing up, but like in high school, no. I just played baseball in high school. I was thinking about playing football, but I <laughs> don't like uh, all the practices. <laughs> so. You like the contact? No, no. And I was like, I told the coach I would I would come if I just had to show up and I'd just run go routes. That's all I would do. You could probably yeah. be like a Deshaun Jackson. Yeah, yeah. So That's what I wanted to do. They usually go for that, don't they? Yeah. <laughs> you would think, but they didn't. Uh, they didn't allow that. So. That play yesterday. I mean, you're full out all the way. It looked like. Is that kind of a testament that now you're everything is behind you? You're yeah, I line. thought. I mean, I felt really good yesterday. Um, everything that I did, you know, I was able to base run, able to to hit fine, to run fine. So yeah, I think that's just a testament of um, our staff in the uh, training room and our docs and get me right. Yeah, yeah. Did they talk about your routes. Like, there's people that's like when I ask the question about what is what, what is it about Lake Perkins because they like the routes a lot. Is that a natural thing too, like with the jumps, or like how do you, like, how, do I, you how do you make I, that happen? I believe it's I you know I made it a really big priority when I first got drafted to that wasn't going to be an area of weakness for me. Um, 
I think just time and experience, man. I don't, I don't believe that I do anything crazy different than anyone else. I just, maybe I have a feel for it. Uh, maybe it is a little bit natural, but a lot of work and time too. It's just like it naturally gives you superhuman energy. No, no, by no means that. I just, like I said, I've been, I mean, this is my 10th season now, so it's been a while. It's a lot of B live BPs and games I've played. Do you ever get worked up? Or are you always in? <laughs> no, I get worked up, man. I, I just try my best not to... I try my best to be the same guy no matter what. That's what what I want of my teammates, and I'm sure that's what they want of me. They don't want, you don't want to be up and down every day. Uh, so, try my best. Can you talk about your, excuse me, can you talk about your second time? Did you change anything mechanically or... or Hitting wise when you got in the, that time. I mean, I, I think it's kind of like a placebo thing. Like you might tell, I might tell myself I'm doing something different, but it doesn't look any different. It's just kind of in my head. It's a yeah. confidence thing. It's a hey, let's try something different. But like in the end, my swing is most likely going to look the same, be the same. Okay. At this point, um, I try not to worry too much about mechanics. Nothing conscious in it. No. Just, yeah. Yeah.